Hello, my name is James Murphy, and I'll be explaining what Segar's Flash Breakpoint software is, and will demonstrate how it can make the embedded programmer's life much easier. Most embedded system applications exceed the RAM size of modern microcontrollers. This requires to utilize flash memory during the debug process. However, flash memory presents breakpoint limitations that can result in lost time and frustration. Let's take a look at a common toolchain debugging on ARM7 target hardware without flash breakpoint enabled. ARM7 devices are limited to two hardware breakpoints, so let's go ahead and take advantage of those. You can see creating the breakpoints is easy, and we can jump to them as necessary. But what happens when we try to create a third breakpoint? The debugger lets us know that it failed to set the breakpoint. In our JLIN control panel, you can see what breakpoints are currently being utilized. Here you can see that two breakpoints are implemented in hardware. In our settings tab, we can now enable the flash breakpoint software. With this enabled, let's see if we can create a few more breakpoints. Yes, we can. The debugger allows it, and we can see these additional breakpoints are now set in flash. Now you can take full advantage of the unlimited flash breakpoints and understand how Sager's flash breakpoint software provides a more productive debugging experience. Thank you for watching.